Well, an Army veteran on a mission to walk across America strolled through Fredericksburg today. He is raising awareness and money for military families. Troy Yoakum's journey began last April in Louisville. He touched the Pacific in San Diego on Veterans Day. So far, he's raised $125,000, all the while accompanied by his dogs, Harley and Emmy. KXN's Jacqueline Inglaze met with Yoakum today and joins us with the story new at 10. Jackie? David Yoakum has walked more than 4,000 miles in the last nine months, averaging between 25 and 30 miles a day. He says his only worry is what will happen to his walk if somehow he cannot continue. Now, he's already had to deal with a few setbacks. His dog almost died, and he lost his mobile camper when it broke down. Every step Iraq War veteran Troy Yoakum takes comes with a beat on his drum. He's hiking 7,000 miles cross country to raise awareness and money for hurting veterans. An average day, 18 veterans in America are killing themselves. And I thought, this is not a coincidence. The economy has dropped off. A personal email he received while deployed in Iraq from an army buddy down on his luck got him pounding pavement. Somebody needs to step up and help. I knew that I couldn't really ask or tell anybody to do something as crazy as this. But at the same time, I knew that maybe I was just crazy enough to walk across America. He says he's used to dodging cars, peeing on roadsides, and has already gone through six pairs of shoes. I've had to endure kidney stones. My wife has been sick with the flu several times. My dog caught a disease that almost killed her. His dog, Emmy, is also taking the trek. She's a therapy dog for wounded warriors. And I thought it's her destiny to walk side by side with me across America. She's logged close to 2,000 miles. His Chihuahua Harley, only 40. Like the dogs, Yoakum relies on sponsors and the goodwill of strangers for food and shelter. I'm trying to cut more and more weight off. Ever since Thanksgiving, people have been feeding me and feeding me and feeding me. Yoakum is also out to create a free day of shipping on care packages to deployed soldiers. Care packages while you're deployed are like your lifeline. It, it's your ability to connect with home. He's asking mayors, congressmen and women, and governors to sign this baseball bat. Fredericksburg Mayor Tom Musselman penned his name to show support. Yoakum will head to Austin this Thursday. He says he's reached out to Governor Perry to sign his bat, but hasn't heard back. Jay Leno and Diane Sawyer have signed it, and Yoakum says he'll sit at the Capitol until Perry meets him. Sure? Following his trip to Austin, he'll walk to San Antonio, where he'll hand out laptops to wounded soldiers. He used donated money to purchase them.